To respond to a review with AI, just find the review you want to reply to. Click Respond and then click Generate AI Response in the pop-up. The tool will create a response based on the customer's review. If you like the response, just click Submit and it will be posted directly to your profile. If you're watching this, you probably already know how important it is to get Google reviews as part of your marketing game. But responding to those reviews is just as important. It helps build trust with your customers. The downside, it can be a real time suck to reply to each review in a personal way that really speaks to what the customer said. And you don't want to just copy and paste the same reply over and over. That just looks lazy. That's where AI steps in. In the example I just showed, I was able to reply to a Google review in just three clicks and I still made it personal, all thanks to a simple AI tool. Now, I know that using AI for content is still controversial and you might be wondering if it's risky to use for replying to Google reviews and if it could mess with your Google business profile. The good news, as long as you're not using AI to game the system or mess with search rankings, you're in the clear. With that sorted, let's dive into the AI tools that can make responding to your Google reviews a breeze and show you how to use them to save a ton of time. Before I do, for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Luc Durand. I've spent the last 15 years helping hundreds of local businesses like you improve their online visibility, climb Google's rankings and attract more customers. If you're currently struggling and want some one-on-one -on -one help with your Google business profile, or boosting your website's visibility, you can grab a private session with me. There's a link in the description below. Alternatively, subscribe to the channel. Enough said, let's get back to our test. For this test, I'm going to check how good the AI tools are at creating real human-like responses that feel personalized to the reviewer for both positive and negative reviews without much help from a human. I'll also check if they can work in different languages and how well they can adjust to different tones or styles. Let's begin with the first tool, GMB Everywhere. While it's technically not a standalone tool, GMB Everywhere is a highly versatile Google Chrome extension. I use it all the time. It has lots of great features. Once installed, you can access a series of AI tools directly from your Google Business Profile Management interface that helps you optimize your Google Business Profile. One of these tools is a review response generator. It's super simple to use. Just click on Generate Review Response. Find the review you want to reply to on your Google Business Profile. Copy the content and paste it into the first box. You can add extra details if you want. By default, your business name will already be filled in, but you can change it if needed. You can also choose the tone of voice for your reply, which is a nice feature, and pick the language from a fairly long list. Then click Generate Response, and within seconds, you'll get a custom reply based on what the customer wrote. You can adjust your settings and regenerate responses as many times as you want, but does it sound like a human wrote it? I'd say yes, definitely. But even though the response sounds very natural, I'd still recommend you check it and make any changes before using it. If you like the response, just click copy and paste it directly into your Google business profile. Now, let's see how it handles negative reviews. One great thing about this AI tool is that it's not tied to just one Google business profile, so you can use it for any review from any business listing. You can either change the business name in the extra details section or remove it entirely. Let's use another dog walking business as an example and see how it handles a negative review. The response still sounds pretty human, but I wouldn't suggest copying and pasting it directly because it seems too generic and doesn't address the complaint like I would want it to. Handling negative reviews needs to be done with extra care because these are often the reviews that potential customers will read the most. They want to see how the business owner deals with unhappy customers. To make the response better, use the extra detail section to give further instructions like using the customer's name if available, and by providing the manager's direct contact number, for example. Also, choose a more serious tone of voice instead of a friendly one, which I think is more appropriate for negative reviews. Then regenerate the response and you'll see a big improvement. It's much more personalized and professional than what I would have come up with on my own. 
do a final read through and make any last tweaks and then you can safely copy and paste it onto your Google business profile for everyone to see. Conclusion, the Google review response generator from GMB Everywhere is a solid tool that does a great job of creating human-like responses in different languages and styles. The interface is very sleek and easy to use, which makes it simple for any business owner to quickly respond to positive reviews, especially for those of you who have never used AI before. On the dance side, the tone of voice and language options are preset, which might feel a bit limiting, but they should still cover 90% of your needs. Handling negative reviews may take a little more effort and proofreading. Overall, I'd rate this tool a 7 out of 10. All right, let's move on to our next tool, one you're all probably familiar with, ChatGPT. Yes, you can use ChatGPT to respond to your Google reviews provided you're using the right prompt. Think of it as a more flexible version of GMB everywhere, but without the fancy interface. Here is how it works. First, create a ChatGPT account if you don't have one already. Next, find the Google review you want to respond to and copy it. Let's use the same review from our previous example. Now, head over to ChatGPT and enter the following prompt. Write a response to the following Google review. Then paste your review and press enter. Just like GMB everywhere, ChatGPT will generate a response based on the review. Does it sound human? Absolutely. However, as with most AI generated content, you might need to tweak it slightly. Let's compare what ChatGPT produced with what GMB Everywhere generated. I'll give you a couple of seconds so you can read it. And it's fair to say the results are quite similar. However, unlike GMB Everywhere, ChatGPT doesn't come with an interface offering preset options to customize your responses. To get similar results, you'll need to prompt ChatGPT further. For instance, if you want to change the tone to something quirky, Simply ask ChatGPT and it will rewrite the response in your desired tone. What about languages? Just prompt ChatGPT to write your response in the language of your choice. Since I'm French, let's ask ChatGPT to translate the review response into French so I can assess its accuracy. The results, I can confidently say it's very good. Now, let's tackle the same negative review we responded to when using GMB everywhere with the same prompt. Respond to the following review. Paste your review and hit enter. The response is excellent. It even suggests the client reach out to the business to address their concerns and find a resolution. To customize this further, you might suggest including the client's name from the review and providing the manager's direct phone number. And voila! you now have a top-notch response to a negative review perfectly tailored to what the client said. All that's left is to copy and paste the response into your Google business profile. Conclusion, when it comes to responding to positive reviews, ChatGPT and GMB everywhere are pretty much on par. However, for negative reviews, it looks like ChatGPT has a slight edge. Plus, there are no limitations when choosing your tone of voice, as there's no preset list to choose from, and you can translate responses into almost any language. The downside, using ChatGPT requires you to craft the right prompts instead of selecting options from a drop-down menu, which can be a bit daunting if you're new to it. But overall, I'd rate ChatGPT a solid 8 out of 10 for responding to Google reviews. Our next tool is Google's AI, known as Gemini, which is very similar to ChatGPT. To use Gemini, all you need is a Google account. If you don't have one, simply create one, then head over to gemini.google.com. The interface is quite similar to ChatGPT's. All you need to do is enter your prompt and you're good to go. So let's try Gemini using the same prompt and Google review we used for ChatGPT and GMB everywhere. The result is just equally as good as the previous tools and could easily be copied and pasted into your Google business profile. But don't forget to proofread it first and make changes if necessary. Next, let's ask Gemini to rewrite the response in a quirky tone of voice. The result is also very good, although it seems a little bit short. Now, let's test how it handles languages by asking Gemini to write the response in French. Once again, I can vouch, this is very good indeed. What about answering negative reviews? In this scenario, 
Gemini really stands out. The response was not only well crafted, but also included a suggestion to add a contact number and email address right away, making it easy for the customer to reach out. When I refined the prompt and asked Gemini to include a client's name and the manager's phone number, Gemini delivered what is probably the best response so far. All you need to do is replace the brackets with the correct information and paste the review response into your Google Business Profile. In conclusion, I think Gemini is better than both ChatGPT and GMB everywhere. Since it's made by Google, it excels at handling multiple languages and crafting excellent responses. I could have used one less prompt and still gotten awesome results. Plus, since most people already have a Google account, you can start using Gemini right away. So, thumbs up for Gemini. I'd rate it 9 out of 10. The last AI tool I want to show you is from Bright Local. If you haven't heard of Bright Local, it's a platform that offers tools for local search marketing like local SEO, reputation management, and citation building. One cool feature of their reputation management tool is the ability to respond to Google reviews directly from the platform using AI. You don't need to copy and paste reviews or come up with your own prompt. All you have to do is sync your Google business profile with Bright Local. Once that's done, go to the reputation management menu on the left hand side, click on monitor reviews and then on the review tab. This will show you all the reviews on your Google business profile. To respond to a review with AI, just find the review you want to reply to. Click respond and then click generate AI response in the pop-up. The tool will create a response based on the customer's review. If you like the response, just click submit and it will be posted directly to your profile. This is a really handy feature, but unfortunately, it's one of the few good things about this tool. If you don't like the response it generates, you can try again, but only up to three times in 24 hours, which is pretty limiting. There doesn't seem to be an option to change the language or tone of the response either. And when I tried it on negative reviews, the responses were nowhere near as good as the other tools. And you can't add specific information or prompt to the tool either to change the outcome. In short, the best part of this tool is that it's connected to your Google business profile. So you can post responses automatically. This feature is very disappointing, especially from a platform like Bright Local, which usually offers better tools. And because of this, I'd rate this AI tool three out of 10. So in my opinion, if you want to respond to Google reviews using AI, your best bet is Google Gemini and ChatGPT, as long as you're okay with entering your own prompts. For ease of use, GMB Everywhere is the best choice and I wouldn't recommend using Bright Local at all. To build your reputation further, try keeping your five-star reviews at the top of your Google listing and combine them with well-written responses. And if you want to learn how to keep five-star reviews at the top of your listing, you'll want to watch this very short video next.